guys, today I'm going to show you how I kind of do my everyday, um, kind of smoky eye using my BH Cosmetics Day and Night Palette. So if you're interested, keep on watching. Okay, so to start off, I'm going to prime my eye with Urban Decay's Primer Potion. Just a little bit. And kind of bring it around under your eye. Okay. So, next thing you're going to do is take a crease brush, and I'm using my Beach Stay and Night palette, and I'm going to use this light brown color. I don't know if you guys can see that, like that, right there. And fill in crease. Okay, just like that. And then I'm going to take a shadow brush, small one. It's um the I got it in naked too. So, and then I'm going to take this light champagne color. It's kind of sparkly, but we're gonna put something over it so it doesn't matter. Just and fill in your corner and like the first half of your eye. And then go back with your crease brush and kind of like blend it out. Okay, now I'm going to take my Naked 2 palette and use the color Verve right there and go over that. Just because it's not like sparkly enough as I would like it. Okay, and then I'm going to take the same crease brush and go back in and blend it out. Okay, then I'm going to go back to my BH Cosmetics palette and take a bigger shadow brush and take this dark um, sparkly purple color, kind of purple, and fill in the outer half of my eye. And kind of just blend it out because it's kind of dark. Okay. Blend that out again. And to kind of like not have that like really harsh line, I'm going to go back and take the small shadow brush and just kind of go over and blend it out. So it's not so harsh. Like that. Um, now I'm going to take the back. Oh, so a big brush kind of and take the black color and fill in my outer V kind of blend it out Kind of want it a little bit darker. Just don't like when you do it, don't take a whole bunch of like black on your brush because you kind of want to like work it up just in case you want it lighter or darker. Okay, like that, and then blend it out one more time. 
just so there's not extremely harsh lines. Okay, then I'm going to take a smudging brush and take that black color again and drag it under my eyes. Only the, uh, the bottom half. And then in so using the same brush, go back using the color Verve in your Naked palette and do the first half of your eye. Get in your corner and just kind of like run into it like that. And then for eyeliner, oh wait, wait for that. <laughs> want to highlight color so take another crease brush and I'm going to mix these two shades together it's like a white and then that um, champagne -y color for my highlight and just kind of just to brighten underneath your eyebrows so like that and I'm now taking your eyeliner I don't know where I put it oh I'm using Jordana Fabu liner it's like a liquid liner but it's like a pen, much nicer than liquid liner, because I cannot put liquid liner on. Um, I'm going to start like kind of halfway, like in the middle, and then just bring it out. Make sure you get really close okay so now to wing out my liner I use don't have it hang on and then to wing out my liner I use NYX's The Curve the only way I can wing out my liner. So it looks like this. Um, when I wing out my liner, I follow like the shape of my eye. So kind of like follow that and like make your straight line up. That's how I do it. So following that, I'm going to make mine up. Um, then I connect it. And then you can go back and fill it in. Like that. And then for mascara, I'm going to use Great Lash. Lots of love mascara. Just, it's a little one to get all your lashes. Um, so I just do one coat of this. to kind of give them a coat. And then I'm going to use Maybelline the Mega Plush. So those are the eyes, and then for foundation, I'm using my Naked Skin and the um, Optical Blurring Brush from Urban Decay. So I just squeeze a little on there, and then start tapping it on, and kind of blending out. And then the other half. 
little on my forehead. So that's foundation. And then for blush, I'm going to take NYX's Rose Petal. It's um, cream blush. Just get it on the apples of my cheeks. Okay, and then for lipstick, I am using Think Pink and it's Wet n Wild. Okay, and that's the finished look, guys.